Hey, it's uh, it's been a while since the last update video, uh, but we're here. 500,000 subscribers, I go, what the f- it's, uh, it's a little crazy, a little insane. Honestly, I don't think I've even like emotionally registered anything that has happened in the past like three months. I like, I, <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Like, I, I don't think I fully understand the scope of like what what has happened or like the things that I've done. It's weird. Because like yeah, Friday night fucking oh gosh hello yeah Annie yeah I love them. You know, it's just like are there are there kids at school talking about Garcello? Are there kids at school like thinking about Atsu over <laughs> right now sitting in their desk and just like like not <laughs> like listening to making day or something? That's surreal to me. I don't know if it's actually happening, but hey, I mean that's crazy if it actually is. <laughs> But yeah, just, um, this is a lot, uh, and I don't know how to feel about it. I'm definitely happy overall, but now it kind of brings, like, this sort of uncertainty, because, you know, I talked about it in my Keeping Up video, right? How do I keep up with it, I guess? You know, like, I guess the expectations that I'm mostly putting on myself, but I assume that other people, some of you guys have of me, it's, it's weird. I had this attitude where I was like, hey, you know, I'll do whatever I want, right? I'm gonna feel so free. You know, I've gotten enough of a fan base, like, just for me, as myself, that I could probably do anything, I think. You know, try different things, or or not. I mean, just whatever I feel like it, right? But I'm still just, like, really, really just, ooh. Still hesitating, and I, and I honestly still don't feel like I deserve any of this. <laughs> Past few weeks, I've just been me kind of just looking at everything up till this point, you know, because there's been a lot of change since, you know, especially since the beginning of this year, or even back then when I was really struggling with this channel and making stuff. <laughs> Afraid that I wasn't going to be able to succeed anymore trying to do what I want to do, but I mean, at this point, I think I currently am. I think for myself, I'll acknowledge that finally. <laughs> there's a lot of just weird stuff about it. 500,000 and for what? I guess. I don't know. I don't want to make it seem like I'm forgetting the things that I've done, because it kind of seems like I'm doing that, where I'll be like, what, what do I even do? You know? Smoke em out struggle. I made all these songs and stuff, all the like, videos and everything, with like millions of views. And personally, I still feel like there's something missing there. Sometimes it just doesn't feel like I've earned it. Like, why am I the one with the funny big number when there are so many other people that should have this number? I don't know, I don't really, I mean, sure it holds meaning, but like overall, like, does it? I don't know. <laughs> feeling, feeling uneasy, a little, a little weird. You get the gist, hopefully. It's all over the place. <laughs> But I guess what I'm trying to get at is that I have half a million subscribers now, but it doesn't- it doesn't feel like it, I guess? Or it doesn't look- it just- it doesn't feel right to me, you know? Like, I guess, personally, the stuff that I've been putting out, it doesn't feel like it's worthy of, like, a half a million. Of course, most of it is from Funkin'. I know a lot of you are even kids that are just subscribed because Funny Garcello and Annie, right? But I know that someone listening to me right now, you probably still at least care about me in some capacity. And I'm thankful for that. And I really want to make you guys proud, but also mostly myself, because I haven't felt proud of much that I've been making recently, even though it hasn't been much. Like, I don't know, it's weird. Like I could be doing so much more. It's hard because I don't take, I don't take my time and Honestly, I, I have a hard time even starting things because of how much time it would take. I don't know why I'm afraid of like spending a month making something because uh, I'm afraid that my channel's gonna die while I'm gone or something, I don't know. It's just a lot of really nonsensical, it doesn't make sense why I'm worried about these things, but I am and it's just like... <laughs> but yeah, like I'm at a point where I can make money off of this. I could probably even live off of doing this stuff and that that excites me and terrifies me at the same time, you know? I thought I never deserved a single dollar for any of the things that I made back then. I never took commissions. I still don't. It's kind of the reason why I broke down in the first Just Drawing stream. If you haven't seen it, I did end up crying because it was like Clover just kind of pushed me to turn on Super Chat for the first time. I didn't even know what it was and I had to look, I had to look up what it was in the middle of the stream and find out for myself, and then I turned it on and suddenly people were giving me money and I'm like, terrified. It's like, why? <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I, I really want to get at it now, you know? I want to upgrade my equipment, you know, maybe get a new PC. Mine's kind of outdated, starting to get outdated a little bit, you know? Maybe a new microphone. Hopefully you'll, I mean, hopefully you'll still be able to hear the insane clicking. <laughs> Since most of you like that, I know some of you don't, but, yeah. I kind of like it. You know, just higher quality, just everything. 
really go hard on it. I'm also in the process of like redesigning like kind of the overall aesthetic that I want to have. I cleaned up my logo recently. I'm trying to brainstorm a new background and like overall like just clean stuff up. Actually like kind of solidified the identity now with whatever I even do. <laughs> you know, it's auto over, I guess, I don't, whatever that means. I guess what I'm trying to get at is like, I'm gonna be taking my time a lot more. I know I've been kind of pumping out a lot of things uh, over the past few months. I've had a bit of a drive, but because I haven't really been proud of most of it, you know, I really want to work on something. If I had to say what, it'd probably be the Miss Mediocre vocal cover, but also a whole animated music video that spans the whole length of the song. That's just kind of one of the plans that I have. To make something big like that. Something to show off everything, because the thing that I've always wanted to do is like make my own music, but also animate things to it, whether it be music videos or like stories or anything. Just, just kind of combine all of the skills that I have and just poop something out, you know? <laughs> but you know, that doesn't mean I'm just gonna disappear for like a few months or anything, you know, I'll still- live streams have been the most fun I've had in a while. Those are super enjoyable, and I'll definitely- maybe I might even stream progress of it, you know? I'm not saying that everything is just gonna be like, oh, I'm announcing this big project and I'm gonna be working on it for a while and that's all you're gonna hear about, no. Like, it's just gonna be- again, I'm gonna take my time, and it's- it'll be done when it's done, and that goes for anything else I- I make. I mean, I'll really try to make bigger and better things for myself, for me to be proud of, and just put my all into it. But of course, I'm, you know, I'll make whatever I want, uh, whenever I feel like it, and however long it takes. Like, I'll have the big stuff, but I'll also have the little whatever posts, like, just really dumb, goofy stuff. And, you know, maybe just switch it up a little, you know, like right now. Boom. No more Roblox parkour. <laughs> We're going into Monster Hunter. Because it's not like- I, I don't spend like 24 hours a day just playing parkour. It's just, you know, mix it up. But yeah, those are- that's just kind of like what I've been thinking about recently. I don't- I still don't really feel like I deserve any of this. I'm still super thankful for all of the support, but man, I really need to like get on the same page with myself. I think we've already established that I'm good enough for you, but I'm still not good enough for myself yet. Oh yeah, good enough, it's fun. You see, like the song that I made, it's really funny. But yeah, I mean, you know, I already said I was moving on from Funkin' a while ago. Like, I know I have Annie. I've been posting some stuff about that. And honestly, I just, I don't even know what's gonna happen with it. At first I was going to release it just in its raw form, you know, just like asset replacement. Annie's been a skin mod, like, since the beginning, right? And I was going to release an update and it was still gonna be a skin mod, right? And I was scared that people were going to be disappointed in that. So I thought I was going to actually spiffy it up and, and make it a total executable and whatnot. But I haven't done that yet. And I don't know if I'm actually going to, because I've just, you know, I've already, like, lost interest. It's already done. You know, it doesn't have, like, cutscenes, it doesn't have all the fancy bells and whistles, but it was just something I wanted to at least finish up on. But I really can't say if or when it's going to actually be out. That goes for any funking thing. I know a lot of you have heard about Smoke Em Out Struggle Plus. Uh, I'm not really involved in that. That's mostly Rage Miner and the team that she's put together. I'm not really in charge of Plus, so I can't really say much about that either. So yeah, I mean, Funkin'? I don't know. No more Friday, Friday Night Funkin'? No. <laughs> you know, it's weird because, like, I never even felt part of the community, I guess. Like, yeah, sure. Well, okay. See, like, definitely a part of the community, yeah. I mean, Smoke Em Out Struggle is, like, the second biggest mod right now, or for however long it's gonna be. But clearly, Garcello's pretty popular, and, you know, he's, he's a part of it. But, you know, I'm not spending my Sunday afternoon drinking coffee with Cade Developer just like, hmm. <laughs> You know, like, I don't- I don't interact with any other modder, like, you know, the most I did was, uh, collaborate with Rec D on Smoke Em Out Struggle with Lyrics, and that was pretty fun. You know, I probably wouldn't have been willing to do that if, like, I just didn't even feel like it in the moment, but in the moment I was like, hey, that'll be fun. So, you know, that was really enjoyable, and I rarely directly meet new people now. Obviously, because I have barely any method of communicating with me at all effectively, because I don't have my DMs open on anything, I don't have a Discord server, I don't have- I'm cracking my- that's funny. Oh, uh, but yeah, you know, I don't have anything open, it's because I'm not. I did have them open for, like, a brief period, and I was even following people on Twitter, if you can even believe it, uh, back then, but, I mean, at this point, if I opened up DMs or any contacts, I- I die. Um, so, any sort of email or whatever, like, like, what- <laughs> 
what am I what am I to do when like 5,000 children knock on my door and ask if I can help with their Friday Night Funkin mod that they think is going to be the next big thing? I can't even like effectively read my comments anymore. I used to be able to when I wasn't this big, but like you know I, I could read everyone's like really nice messages and like really kind of heartfelt. But now I go to my comment feed and I have like you know <laughs> smoke about struggle uh, with like a child. <laughs> Just like, when I have everything flooded with like the hive mind that everyone sees the top comment and it's probably a joke and then they, they type the exact same thing because they think they're gonna get likes as well. Oh my god, dude. <clears throat> what am I going to do when I already have to sit through hundreds of comments that are like, Did you know that uh, you can hear fading? in any song, Lover, even though Lover came before Fading, and what I'm trying to say is that Fading is the one that has a Lover reference in it, and it's not the other way around, but everyone keeps saying that because it's like, ooh, fun fact that you didn't know even though the comment section is flooded with the entire, everything about it. Take a swig of this, you go there, it's like, oh, the, the human body is made of 70% water, and then everyone's like, oh, Annie, it, it, you know? I <laughs> Any of my song videos, they're like, oh, and oh, I'm bad at singing. Everyone, oh, she lied to us. I, I didn't even say that I'm bad at singing ever since, like, good enough. I haven't even directly said that I'm bad at singing. I'm just, oh my god, I, just, I miss, I miss, I kind of miss having a smaller community, I'm gonna be honest. Sure, I was distant with communication back then, but at least I could, like, I felt kind of connected, but now it's like, it's so broad, it's so large that like, it's kind of hard with the things that I've set in place that like, you know, I can't really connect. And collaborating and meeting new people hasn't been like a priority for me, but it's just, at this point, it'd probably be nice. I've been isolating myself from everything for such a long time, and I don't know, it's definitely helped me out, but I think I'm slowly starting to get the confidence to kind of be more out there again. It's just hard when I don't even feel like I know where to fit or where to even start. I guess, without being bombarded with messages and everything. Things I've heard, questions I've heard and answered like hundreds of times before. I don't know, it's just, I'm complaining about a lot, but a lot of stuff. It's, it's a lot. Big number, big things that I want to make, big everything. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'll just take it easy now. Things take time, uh, and even though we have a limited amount of it, as mortal beings, I guess. <laughs> uh, it's still a lot. I got one shot. One opportunity to do what makes me happy right now. And uh, I guess I'll be doing that. Maybe make a Patreon or something. I don't know. I don't know if a Patreon will even feel right, but we'll see. Hopefully this video wasn't too... It's probably all over the place. I'm like trying to retrace the things that I've said. And I honestly, at this point of recording, I can't even remember what like half of the things that I said. So I just hope that uh, you got the gist. <laughs> And I don't have to repeat, like, me summarizing the thing over and over again because I keep forgetting. So yeah, um, I hope y'all are well. Uh, thank you, and I love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>